All right, we're recording. All right, I'm Kate Brown. My first problem is 2.4, number one. So the question is asking about this graph here, and it just asks about um, a bunch of the different limits and then whether they're true or not. So the first one is the limit as x approaches negative one on the positive side and that equals one, which would be correct. So we're approaching negative one on the positive side, it equals one right here, this is a solid dot. So that would be true. And then going on to B, we have the limit as x, uh, the limit as x approaches zero from the left equals zero. So this one, we're going to zero from the left, which is here, which is an open dot. So that is false. Right, because remember that when you take a limit, I mean, obviously we've seen now all of these cases where you do just compute limits by plugging the numbers in. But fundamentally, when we take a limit, we don't care what happens at the value itself. We only care what happens as we approach the value. So as we approach zero, y is going down to zero. Okay, and now C is asking, if the limit of f of x as f x approaches zero from the left is one, which is obviously false because you just said that it is zero as x approaches zero from the negative. D is the limit as x approaches zero from the left. Does it equal the same as the limit of the as x approaches zero from the right, which is true, they both approach zero from both sides. E is the limit as x approaches zero exists, which since there is a hole, oh no, it does exist even though there is a hole. Yeah. That's right. Yep. Okay, and then F, the limit as x approaches zero of f of x equals zero, which is true as you're approaching zero you are going down to zero. G, limit of f of x as x approaches zero equals one. We just stated that it equals zero, so that's false. H, the limit of f of x as x approaches one equals one. So if we're coming up here and approaching one, we're coming from two different directions, getting two different values. That would be false. I, the limit as f of x approaches one equals zero, which again is incorrect because we're approaching from two different, from each side it's a different value. So false. J is the limit of as x approaches two from the left equals two. So we're approaching two from the left and that is true, it will equal two. K the limit as x approaches negative one from the left does not exist. Um, so we're approaching negative one from the left, which is true because we don't have any graph right here. And then the limit as x approaches two from the right equals zero, which is false because again, we don't have a graph outside of two. And then I'll show you the whole So those, that is everything we just stated. Thank you. Not the possibly not 